Now that I've installed the new RAM and the new hard drives, I turn the computer back on and if I go to About This Mac, more information, you can see that there's 16 gigabytes of memory. If I go to Storage, you can see the two hard drives, so the SSD drive and the original mechanical hard drive. And if I go to Memory, you can see that there's 16 gigs on the two 8 gigabyte chips that I installed. If I open up Finder, you can see the data drive and the SSD drive. And one of the things I want to do, since the SSD drive is pretty small, I want to move my users folder onto the, the data hard drive. This way, all my files, my documents, my music, my videos, etc., will all be stored on the large mechanical hard drive and the operating system and the apps, the things that are most resource intensive, will be stored on the solid state drive. So the first thing that you want to do is go to the SSD drive and copy the users folder, then go to the data drive and paste it. So this will paste an exact copy of that folder onto your other hard drive. So when the users folder has been pasted onto the other hard drive, next thing you want to do is open your system preferences. And under system preferences, under the system section, there's a icon called users and groups, and you'll see the user. Now down at the bottom here there's a lock, so I want to make changes to this. So it's going to ask for my password. And now it's unlocked, so if I right click on my user, advanced options, it says where the home directory is located. So I want to choose a new one. So I'll go to data, users, and I'll select my name and do OK. And you'll need to restart the computer. So I will restart. OK, so my computer is restarted now. And if I go back into Finder and I click on the solid state drive where my home directory used to be located and I click on it, you'll notice now my directory just has a plain old folder and if I go into the data drive it has the home icon indicating that this is the home directory of the present logged on user. So the last thing that I want to do now is go back to my solid state drive and just delete that users folder because now it's just wasting space on that drive. And that's it. I can just use my computer as normal. However, anytime I save stuff to any of my user directories, it will be on the mechanical hard drive. This not only uh, saves space on the solid state drive for applications and things, it makes it easy. If I ever need to reinstall the operating system, none of my data will get touched. It will all be there. And if I ever need to uh, back up this hard drive, it's just simple. I just copy the whole hard drive and back it up to an external drive.